Ritter has a clean pocket and now tries to scramble for the first down. Chased by Jasinski, and there he is. It's a run to move the sticks out to the 39. Second and eight. Ritter fires far side. It's a back shoulder catch by Lewis and another first down in UCF territory. I'd say it's falling out. Pressure hit as he throws, and it's a high over the head of Lewis. That was just hits in the blitz. Fourth down. Uh, he, you see, he didn't stop him once. Milton on the first play from the end zone. Hit balls out in a scrum. Bearcats have recovered it. Touchdown, Cincinnati on UCF's first offensive play. We just talked about last year. Fitz credited with the touchdown recovery. We'll Get another look at it. They're going to replay to see where exactly the ball was recovered, but that's that's yeah. very clear cut. Yeah. Cl Greg McRae, the running back, split wide to the right, and once again pressure, and Milton's not going to escape. Dropped by Cortez Broughton, the senior defensive tackle from Georgia. UCF showing that blitz look again, but they back out. Ritter has a ball batted down at the line. Make use of the short field, and he has hooked it. Missed it wide left. Milton 0 for 3, and it's third and seven. Has protection this time and flips it to Frederick Snelson for a first down. That's more like it. Play action. And down the seam, and the catch is made by Snelson again. They found a matchup they like. As the tailback. And Milton has plenty of time against the three man rush. All day to throw. Heaves it downfield and it's caught inside the 10. McRae, the back, got downfield. Uh, one on one with Snelson. McRae. No, it's a keeper and Mackenzie Milton scoots in for the touchdown. It extends the it drive. Varies, it varies with each crew. Moves the ball to the 42. Now this time Ritter is going to be trapped. That's Joey Connors, the defensive tackle. Man, their guy's inside can pressure. And Charles McClellan in the backfield. He leaks out. Ritter is flushed. Tries to run for it and is going to get the first down and more. Knocked down inside the 25. You can see the long strider at it again. Ritter has space again. And now fires along the sidelines, and it's incomplete. Catch not made in bounds. Thomas Geddes, the receiver, for the lead. And it's blocked. And the Knights have a chance. They got a wall down the sidelines. Brandon Moore still running. Cuts it back and will be dropped inside the 25 on the football right in the middle watch 91 right there he gets his hands up knocks that ball away UCF on the 17 Milton from the pocket loops into the end zone diving catch for a touchdown Adrian Killens has to answer he feed Warren he's got a crease and he's in the loose and it was a pre-snap adjustment that opened the door for him yeah, there yeah the Pressure again. Steps up. Hit as he throws. Incomplete. Brandon Hayes is whipping the O-line. It's about UCF being in those four receiver sets. Downfield shot. Milton slings it. Caught. Trey Nixon down at the 25. Man, he throws a great deep ball. And the inverted wishbone. They're going to throw for it. Love incomplete. They were all over the tight end. Colby Alley. They love that play, but Bearcats are ready for it. And I could. Blitz. Ritter gets it out and overshoots his man. It's going to be incomplete, out of bounds. Lewis grabbed it. Clark was defending, but it's fourth down. Able to get into that backfield. Three yard loss. And now Milton fires in the slot. Catch made by Gabriel Davis, his first of the night. He's near the marker at the 29. Yeah, the Second and eight, Milton. Wanted to go downfield, just checks it down. And Killens able to squirt into Bearcats territory for another first down. <laughs> yeah. Milton from the pocket, zips it across the middle, and a catch is made right at the marker by Snelson. He's been busy tonight. Four-star recruit out of Miami. And Milton, another shot downfield. Catch made, Nixon, touchdown!
to hurry. Blitz, screen. And the catch made by Jackson. And the speedster turns on the Jets and gets to the Knights 39. Wow. Second and 15. Ritter steps up and can't escape. Davis has got him. Got to take a timeout. Down to 12 seconds. And slot to the right can be used in these situations. And Ritter dropped incomplete. No. They took it right out of his hands. Aces took it away from him. Yeah. Watch 10 coming off up here at the top. Watch him just get his right hand, knock the ball away, and then Hayes on the other side says, that's my partner. You knock it away, and I'll jump on top of it. Those defensive ends continuing to impact this football game. Oh. Now trying to stretch the lead here. And this is McCray busting loose. And McCray out near midfield. Back-to-back 100-yard games for the sophomore from Miami coming in. He's been the first half. Needs five on third down. And an error wow. throw. Snelson was, or excuse me, Anderson was wide open. Ball deflected. Yeah. Ten. Right splits. Ball on the ground. And UCS got it. Joey Connors with the fumble recovery. Seen Warren McClellan as a true freshman. It's just a different feel. Ball came in there, looked like a little bit high to McClellan. He's able to handle the snap. See the handoff up high, actually into the face mask there, and that's what knocked the ball out, knocked it loose. And out there on the edge. And Milton has to duck under it. Sack. Heavy pressure there from Kimoni Fitz. Fitz just. Milton escapes. Trying to get the field. Knocked down hard. Yeah, he's just trying to get some of the yards back in that third and very long. Wow. CF history. It's just one on the season, but this is drifting and it slides wide right. Four man rush. Ritter flushed. He's going to try to run. Will he get there? And he's going to be marked out short of the marker. McKenzie said he can now beat his brothers in everything basketball, golf. He runs the show. Flips it short. Killens breaking free. They're not going to catch him. The explosion you expect from UCF. Touchdown. Ritter looking to throw, and it's caught for a first down. In the Knights' territory is Lewis. And here comes the pressure again, and Ritter's going to be dropped. It's another sack by Titus. Davis monster night. I mean, well, you out of the starting blocks. Ritter flushed to his right. It's a long way to run for a first down. He takes a big shot. No sliding there. But wow. Kaczynski hammers him. It's fourth down. And the ball. I think that ball came out. came out. I don't know if he got it back, but that initial contact, that ball definitely came out. That was a serious collision. It's in the hands of Bam Moore. Flags come out at the end of the play. This hit. Watch the ball pop out right at the collision. Oh my gosh, that's a heavy hit by the linebacker. Looks like his right arm got around the football though as he's laying there. I don't know how he had the presence of. I don't either. Look for the ball. I don't either. Boom. I mean, you, you're right. He wasn't thinking of sliding. He 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 was trying to pick up that first down. You admire the toughness Again. of the quarterback on a third and long, but wow. After review, the ruling on the field has changed. The offensive player fumbled the ball and it was recovered by UCF. Oh. And the UCF ball. One running and, and throwing. McCray cuts it back and is knocked down, but not before crossing the plane. And the lights. Take a strong case for him. Ritter. Fires wide open is Lewis who battles hard and gets a first down across the 44. And outside of Auburn found out that was no fun. Yep. Third and three. And first down to Moore for Thomas. Big freshman still rumbling, diving, knocked out short of the goal line. This one buzz down. Sits and he's got the football running a play, so no chance to review it now. And Thomas just barrels down near the goal line. Still no in. signal. Yeah, touchdown. Yeah, he, I'll tell you, as they continue to play these last few games, Golden, 
UCF has found ways to make them pay for it. McGowan's getting loose and busting down to the 40-yard line. Fresh legs as they rotate in backs. Here's Killens is in the game. He scored a couple touchdowns tonight trying to get loose again. Finds a crease and cuts back. He'll be caught from behind, but a nice run down near the 20. Milton scrambling away and slings it along the sidelines, almost intercepted. James Wiggins was over in the neighborhood. B3. An angle. Knocks it right through. Big edge in the kicking game tonight for UCF. And it's a jump ball. Broken up. Brandon Moore, they call him Bam in coverage. And, and that position in this system is, is crucial because he does so many things. You think they'd be able to recruit a quarterback here. They certainly have no pop. Thomas, he shows some wiggle for a big man. It really all. does. And that should be it. So, on this national stage, with all the buzz and all the buildup and the bright lights, Game day's presence this morning on senior night. Guys like Jasinski there, Titus Davis. A sweet and satisfying victory as the winning streak, longest in the country, reaches 23. A 25 point victory over the toughest or at least highest rated conference opponent they faced this season.